This video is recorded and voiced by the artificial intelligence version of Emmanuel. Now I want you to go ahead and pay attention to what the video right, says. Guys. Okay, so as you can see, that is super insane because think about the applicab applicability in your business, how you can be able to use artificial intelligence to be able to generate content. I can be able to use artificial intelligence in your opt-in pages, in your ads. Now I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys in this video how I was able to create that video that you guys just watch. So first thing first, you're going to need to navigate and subscribe to a platform called d-id.com. Okay. That platform again is D. I'm going to write it down here so you can see it. D-id.com. Okay. D-id.com. You're going to need to navigate to that platform. And that's the platform I was able to use to create this. So first thing first, when you create your account, you're going to have two things that look like this. So first, we're going to have to cover three things. We're going to need an image, a still image of us, just like an image of you just facing the camera, you know, shoulders down, um, just like a broad overview image. And then you're going to need an audio recorded. Now, the audio you listened to was an audio that I recorded with my phone. So I went on my phone and I recorded that audio that you guys heard, right? So the first thing first is you're going to need to add a presenter. So when you come here, you're going to need to add a presenter. So when you click add presenter, it's going to navigate you to your images and then all you have to do is pretty much pick an image that you want um, to use. Now, for this video, um, I am going to actually show you guys, we're actually gonna create one from scratch. So the first thing first that I did is, I, I took a picture of myself before I started the recording and then what I want you to do is I want you to go to Canva, go to canva.com and create a Canva account if you don't have one. Click create a design and let's use a design of in Instagram post square. Okay, we're gonna use an Instagram post square. And then just navigate here to the section um, here. And oh, oh, by the way, just so, so I can to, to point out, this does up actually have a tab as well for um, um, what you call, I'm gonna cover that in a future video, where you can actually integrate this tool with canva.com so you can create, um, you can make your videos, your images actually live. Super insane, right? So we basically change an image to video. So what you wanna do now, it's come up here and then upload that image of you, whatever the image of you is. So I'm gonna upload an image of me, like this one here. This was the image I took, all right? And then I'm gonna just upload it. Now, as you can see, I'm not smiling, I'm not doing anything. It's just a plain image of me, right? So I'm gonna just go ahead and crop it, make it bigger. I'm going to go ahead and do this just a little bit. And that, this is just, like I said, I did this before we started the video. And then I'm gonna edit photo, okay? And I'm gonna come up here, background remover. I'm gonna remove the background. And, okay, perfect. The background's been removed. And then I'm gonna just go ahead and come up here. Let's make sure that this is not, uh, it looks a little bit obscured. Okay, good, that's fine. Let's go ahead and download this. Uh, no, 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 no. Remove background. download and then just select transparent background compress the file quality now do whatever you you're used to do and whatever you, you know works best for you you can do that and then we're just going to go in and download it it's titled on you untitled design and then i'm going to come up here back to my did account once again d-id.com click add and they have a free trial as well and i'm going to go ahead and upload that okay so as you can see i'm uploading that image of me and image has been uploaded. So now we have an image of me. Then I'm going to come up here to audio. Now I also took the privilege of recording an audio and actually uploading the audio here into my account. Um, actually just, you know, putting it on my laptop. So I come up here, AI audio, and I click uh, uh, this. And this is the audio file here. And I'm also going to go ahead and, you know, play the audio, play it so you guys can actually go ahead and listen to what we actually created. And then all right, perfect. Let's go ahead and generate video. Okay, so it takes about a few seconds to generate. Um, it takes about anything from a few seconds to a few minutes to actually generate. But once it does generate, it's absolutely insane because all you have to do is now come up here and then click play. 
I am the artificial intelligence creation of the YouTube video that you are watching. As you can see, we created me in a matter of seconds. Obviously, as you can see, the, it's it's kind of a little weird. Um, just it's based off of the way the photo was taken, and I don't think Canva did a good job of actually uh, uh, cropping the background, right? But we can create another video with the same recording. Um, I'll just pick an avatar here. This is just images of myself. I took an image. This is a pictures of myself that I uploaded. And then let's just go ahead and use a different audio. And let's use this audio here. All right. And then once this is done, just go ahead and generate video and generate. All right. And then now it's going to go ahead and generate that video for us. And then ready for it. It's it, all it takes is a matter of a few seconds. It's like a few seconds to a minute to generate the video, as you can see, generated. Depends on the length of your video. I am the artificial intelligence creation of the YouTube video that you are watching. As you can see, we created me in a now, matter of seconds. I want seconds. you to understand something. If you notice the, 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 the image I use is a very distant image. Now, because it's artificial intelligence voice, if you have a headshot, it's going to look more like AI voiced it. So I recommend you want to take a photo that actually has you like zoomed way far out. So that this way, you know, as the head movement to move in, it's not really obstructing anything and people can't really tell it's AI generated. But that's pretty much how you generate. You, you, you can turn an image into a video of yourself and put a recording in there and you can use this for, you know, whatever it is that you're doing. Just go ahead and comment below and let me know. How does how you intend on using this video, uh, using this this tips that you just learned, and obviously go ahead and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in a future video, guys.